Guess what? Our own Mike Levin is there as well and joins us live with an update on SU's quest for the title. Hey there, Jason. Now, they must have known I was coming. Check it out. A nice little welcome for yours truly from Paul Pearson Company. Well, anyways, the Cuse took to the parquet floor today as they prepare for their Sweet 16 matchup against Wisconsin. The Badgers have a formidable defense and they can shoot the three-pointer. They are the number four seed in the East region. Got to this point over Vandy last Saturday after, right after SU's win over Kansas State. So, given the fact that the Badgers have that great defense and they can shoot from long distance, the Orange will have, the, have little margin for error if they want to win. You know, it's, it's a great challenge to play against this team because they're so solid uh, on both ends of the court. Don't make any mistakes, and uh, you know, it's, this will be a, a great challenge for our team. That's the way we've been playing. You know, I think we're one of the hottest teams, especially coming in with you know, so much doubt the way that uh, you know, the media was doubting us, and I'm sure other teams were as well. Um, you know, the way we've been playing, the way we've been executing, you know, especially after our last win against Kansas State, I think that we're you know, on pace to do something real special right now. Seeing as we are here in Beantown, I had a chance to ask a few of the Orange players about what it will be like to play here and just to play in this historic basketball town. You can hear what they had to say a little bit later on tonight. Until then, live in Boston, Mike Levin, News Channel 2 Sports. Jason, back to you. All right, thanks very much, Mike.